Hello, my beautiful beauties and my wonderful lovelies. A pleasant afternoon to you. You know, I remember in 2008, was it 2008? I think it was 2008 when I began having a little bit of interest in political matters. You know, at one point during that saga, I think I said, you know, I think I would do well in politics. But I said, you know what? Immediately I said, let me perish the thought. Let me rubbish the thought because... It is not an aspiring thing these days to say you want to become a politician because automatically there are certain adjectives that will be attached to it. Corruption, you know, mis misappropriation of funds, not caring about the people of Jamaica. And I said, you know what? Sometimes, Tony, and do not let your good be evil spoken of. And you have to just use wisdom. But who knows what the future will bring, you know, by God's grace and mercy. But... I remember 2008 when the Honorable Bruce Golden <clears throat> became the Prime Minister. And I somehow I decided to just focus, you know, zoom in and listen to him. And I found his mind to be very brilliant. I don't know how true it is, but somebody said that he had gotten the highest in his grade in the, is in the world or Caribbean. It's either the Caribbean or the world in his master's. Whatever he did his master's in, in that particular area, he had got the second highest. So it could be in the world or the Caribbean. A feat that many can only dream of. And I recall the US dollar for his four and a half year that he was prime minister. It, it, it slowly moved. Slowly moved. And he wanted to break down. You know, when... when um. Not what's it, what's the name of that particular uh, king that um, ruled for uh, Joash was his name or jo jo what's his name again? But he tore down all of the idols that were against God. You know, I know his name begins with J. And uh, I saw the where Bruce Golding wanted to whatever you know that took place. He said, you know what, we're going to start on good footing. And then the Dudu saga came. And everything just went through the door. That was just a, the major hindrance to him not getting a second term or a third term even. And to hear a politician disrespect, disregard, degrade, I mean, was quite vitriolic, rude and out of order to be speaking about the former prime minister like that. May God help him. May God help that man. Guys, follow me on TikTok, subscribe to my YouTube channel, share this.